We got Hazlitt on the back. Yes, sir. Oh, my goodness gracious. Yes, sir. Check out that Gladiators logo. Yes, sir. I also got the back plate on the bottom. Today, y'all are about to find out what's inside my 2021 football practice bag. Get out. What's up, y'all? My name is Clark Hazlitt, better known as Adventure yeah. Athlete and also known as Clark Country, and welcome back to another video. Yeah. For those of you guys that are new to my channel, welcome. Do me a favor and consider subscribing down in the description below. As of right now, 71% of y'all are not still subscribed, so if you could do me a favor, click that subscribe button down below. It'd be much appreciated. Golly, it's time to bust this bag open. Sheesh. For starters, as y'all can see here, I got my Rydell SPK football pads around my football bag. I'm just gonna put this down. Yeah, oh. We've got my Rydell SPK football shoulder pads. These have been my bad boys for about 12 years. Now I know there's a new pair of shoulder pads out there called X-Pads. I'm trying to get my hands on a pair, but as of right now, I'm still using these bad boys. I also got the back plate on the bottom. Nothing's changed. Some of y'all know Tom Brady's worn the same pair of pads since he was in college. Let's go! Your boy Clark Country's been wearing these pads since I was in high school. And let me tell you what, these have to be the lightest and smallest shoulder pads I've ever worn. And I ain't changing shoulder pads. Unless X-Pads can send me a free pair to check out. It's time to unzip my bag here. And we're gonna pull out the first two items which are very important. I've got two Beasts of China Gladiator logo branded footballs. Go Gladiators. As y'all can see here, these are two Wilson GST footballs. We've also got the CAAF branding for the Czech Republic Association of Football, I believe is right. I make sure I take good care of these balls and y'all can see just the glow because these are so well broken in and taken care of. Oh my goodness gracious. So these are balls are with me at all times. Footballs are the most important thing besides my offensive linemen. And check out that Gladiators logo. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Up next, y'all, we've got my practice jersey. Now, we got issued these practice jerseys last week. Let me tell you, they're pretty cool. As y'all can see on the front, we've got the six. And on the back, we've got the gladiators. Jerseys also got gladiators football on both shoulder pads. This is my first time playing overseas and actually receiving a practice jersey, so this is super cool. Some of y'all probably see me playing in this jersey. Oh yeah, we out here, we in this thing. Yeah. For those of you guys who haven't yet, my most recent video right here, my first football practice in Czech Republic. Make sure y'all check it out. Your boy's repping the six again. Yes, sir. I'm moving on to the next item. Up next, we've got my Zoom Vapor Carbon Nike cleats. Now, let me tell y'all, these are the best cleats ever made to this day. And I believe Nike does not, unfortunately, make these anymore. The best feature about my Vapor Carbons have to be the detachable cleats on the bottom. Out here in Europe, I'm gonna be playing on a lot of grass, so I've got extra studs to make sure that I'm always gonna have good traction. And let me tell you what, boys, the black and white colorway of these things, my goodness gracious, with the sparkle on the toe. I rocked these bad boys back in high school, and now it's super cool nine years later to get to rock them again they're gonna look super swaggy with our uniforms speaking of uniforms i might just have to give you all a little sneak peek of our uniform if i do give you all a little sneak peek you got to do me a favor check out my new song back in my hometown or my other song throwback link down in the description i'll go get the jerseys i'll be right back Starting out with our home jersey. Yes, sir. We got the Gladiators at number six. And guess what? We got Hazlitt on the back. Yes, sir. Oh, my goodness gracious. This is going to be our home jersey for this upcoming year. And then we got the away jersey. We got that white. Yes, sir. And what do you know is on the back. We didn't even get our last names on our college jersey. So it's super cool out here in Czech that they're able to get our last names on the back of our jerseys. So there's y'all sneak peek. Away jersey. Home jersey. Do me a favor. Check out my songs. Up next in my football practice bag. Bag, we've got one of my most favorite items, my football helmet. As y'all can see here, my helmet got a little bit of a makeover last week. It went from the maroon colorway to an all black colorway. I'm just gonna put this bad boy on. Yes, sir. So as y'all can see here, I'm currently wearing a Nike Speed, oh my gosh, cut. I'm currently wearing a Rydell Speed Flex. I've got on a shock chrome visor, and I've also got a Sports Star chin strap with a Nike chin strap cover. I did take the Nike symbol off just because I think it looks a little better without it. Oh my gosh, y'all. This all black colorway with the all black accents, I think is super dope. A big shout out to Green Gridiron for hooking your boy up with the Rydell Speed Flex. Make sure you guys check them out down in the description below. <laughs> Excuse me. 
Ooh, I just can't stop looking at this helmet. Golly, she's gorgeous. One of my favorite accents that I do have on the back of my helmet is the American flag. Shout out to America, I miss y'all. I also have some really good news. For those of y'all that wanna stream and watch my games live here in Czech Republic, you just gotta make sure you're following me on Instagram. I'm gonna be making sure I'm gonna be posting the live stream links for the games and y'all are gonna get the chance to see your boy ball out. Up next, I've got my coach's wristband and two wrist wristbands. Now, let me tell y'all, I've been wearing a coach's wristband for a while now. I always wear this thing around my waist because then I have these two sweatbands around my wrists. Reasons for that is because I sweat a lot during games. So having these wrist wraps helps it so the sweat does not end up getting from my forearm onto my hand. As well as having this QB play card, as y'all know, your boy's gonna be calling plays this year, so I always gotta have my scripts ready to go. So for those of y'all that are in high school or college, if you struggle remembering plays, get yourself a wrist coach because you can always write yourself notes. And then if you ever forget something, you can just check it. It's gonna help you be more confident out on the field. Let's now move on to the next item. Now I gotta let y'all know, this year's a little special for me because I'm not only quarterback, but I'm also offensive coordinator. So whenever I go to practice, I've got all my game plan scripts, all my scouting reports, all my install scripts on this iPad, as well as your boys on the Ox. So you know, I gotta have the fire playlist going during practice. This is gonna be my first year being offensive coordinator and quarterback. So it's gonna be interesting seeing how things go first game. and. If I ever make any bad play calls, y'all are gonna know it's on me, but if we're also tearing it up on offense, y'all are gonna know that guy who's calling the plays is pretty damn good. Let's now move on to the next item in my bag. Up next, I've got two items, a large Gatorade towel and a giant water bottle. Whenever I have my helmet in my bag, I always have this towel wrapped around it so that my visor does not get beat up while my bag's getting thrown around. As well as it's always nice to have an extra towel for after practice. And y'all already know, I need to have a big old jug of water because your boy gets thirsty out on the field. And that just reminds me, it's important to stay hydrated, y'all. Up next, I've got two towels and a pair of no-show socks. Now, let me tell y'all, no-show socks get a lot of hate, but especially for y'all boys that are practicing in the summer right now, and here in Czech Republic, it's currently the summertime. I do not want those nasty mid-sock tan lines, so that's why I'm rocking no-shows. And then I always have two towels with me in case one's a little dirty or one gets super sweaty for my hands. Always come prepared with a backup. This year, I'm gonna be repping the black towel. I think I'm gonna be going for an all-black accent look, so this is what y'all are gonna see out on the field. Up next, I've got my cut-off Nike brand combat undershirt that I wear under my pads as well as I took a black shirt and I cut off the sleeve and I use it as my headband so that whenever I sweat a bunch since I have really long hair right now it always gets caught in the headband instead of sweating on my eyes and then getting on my visor on my helmet for those of y'all that sweat a lot and it gets in your eyes whenever you're in practice or a game definitely recommend wearing a headband last but not least I have two granola bars always in my bag in case I need an extra snack and I have my modus QB throwing tracker now y'all know you always need to have snacks let's talk about the Modus QB tracker. In this sleeve, there is an RFID chip. This chip tracks my throwing during practice. It tracks the amount of reps I have, the velocity of my throws, and it makes sure that I'm never overusing my arm. I'm gonna leave the link to Modus QB down in the description below for y'all to check out. It's super cool how advanced technology is getting and now I can incorporate that into my game to make sure I'm taking care of my arm as well as tracking my progress during preseason. All right, y'all, that's it. My bag is now officially empty. This is just a big old Nike duffel bag. Thank y'all so much for taking the time to watch this video. I hope you guys are enjoying this series here out in Czech Republic. I've got a lot more content coming for y'all soon. And for those of y'all that made it this far in the video, do me a favor and leave a comment down below. Hashtag gladiators. I wanna make sure I take the time to reach out to y'all. And with that, thank y'all so much for showing love and support. I'll see y'all in the next video. Yeah! It's Clark Country, y'all. Come on.